I'm encouraged by what the president said, but it still concerns me that states won't have as much flexibility as I believe we need to have in establishing our own health care plans. You know, I just personally believe Oklahoma knows best about what we need to provide health care at a reasonable cost and to cover our citizens and what a one-size-fits-all from Washington plan does. And in, in the plan that I've seen come forward from the president, it still has the individual mandate in there, which Oklahoma has challenged legally in saying that we don't believe that it's constitutional. And from what I'm hearing, uh, I'm glad there's going to be a little bit more flexibility for states, but if there's still an individual mandate in there, it's, it's still not going to be good for Oklahoma. I'd like to just opt out totally, you know, the health care bill and allow Oklahoma its its ability to innovate and, you know, Oklahoma's already done some things like Insure Oklahoma, which is a wonderful public-private partnership to where an individual pays a portion of the small business pays a portion of the federal government has a, a match in that. And it's proven to be successful for helping those who don't have private insurance. You know, we have some other things we'd like to look at. Uh, maintenance of effort is a huge concern in our Medicaid population. Uh, we'd like to have more granting to the states, and that's one of the things we asked you know, the president today was give us the ability to block grant. We've talked to the speaker about that also. But we just want to have flexibility in the states. Oklahoma, of course, uh, is going to move ahead with the in innovator grant that we received notice of last week because we don't want the federal government coming in in 2014 and telling us what we have to do. Oklahoma wants to find its own solution and we have a deadline to meet by 2014 so we're going to move ahead with our Oklahoma exchange so that we can introduce uh, accountability, transparency, market competition, allow the people of Oklahoma to know what's available in the marketplace so hopefully they can sign up and get health insurance but through the private sector.